Today I want to tell you the history of the Titan and Ocean Gate from 2013 to 2023. A few weeks ago, the Ocean Gate submersible Titan famously imploded with the loss of all five people on board. But in this video, we're going to be focusing on the history of Ocean Gate, the company that built the Titan. Please note, this is only Ocean Gate from 2013 to 2023. In 2013, Ocean Gate decided to design its own submersibles with new designs, and they were more cost effective. Ocean Gate started to work on the design of its first custom built submarine called Cyclops, which was later called Cyclops 1, collaborating with the University of Washington and Boeing. Cyclops was unveiled in 2015. That same year, Ocean Gate's headquarters moved to the Port of Everett Waterfront Center office space in Everett, Washington. In December 2016, the company started to order the first titanium component for Cyclops 2. Cyclops 2 was later renamed to Titan, and Rush said it was an amazing engineering feat in its launch in 2018. Titan reached depths of up to 4,000 meters or 13,000 feet. For some comparison, the Titanic is 3,800 meters or 12,500 feet deep. In 2019, they were planning two more submersibles, the Cyclops 3 and 4. Ocean Gate wanted these new submersibles to go 6,000 meters or 20,000 feet, and in 2020 planned to build it at NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center in Huntsville, Alabama. It costed around $18.1 million. In 2021, Ocean Gate submarine Titan first dived to the Titanic. Sadly, in 2023, en route to Titanic, Titan imploded with the loss of all five people on board and the death of CEO Stockland Rush. Thank you for listening. Please subscribe and like the video.